Welcome, welcome everyone. Happy Friday. Welcome to Spice Isle Cafe for yet another edition. And we are making, guess what? Yes, you guessed it. We're making sea moss. I decided to change up things a bit instead of, you know, I'm making pastries and giving you some kind of food. I decided, well, hello, we need a drink too. And for all my brothers and sisters out there, you know, Seamoss is a bad, bad drink. In a good way, in a good way. <laughs> so Seamoss, this is it when it's dry. It's, it's just like as it sounds, it's com it comes from the sea. It's a, it's a moss and I know we wash it and um, we dry it and it looks like this. And to make that sea moss uh, drink, what we do is we soak it in water and some lemon so that it yields. <laughs> and then I boiled it so, um, you know, it can break apart before I move on to the next step. So. I hope you all enjoyed this video here because I know a lot, I used to make that a lot um, in college. <laughs> so I hope that you all appreciate this video and you don't forget to like, subscribe, and uh, share at the end of this video, okay? So we're making sea moss. I already boiled my um, sea moss and now I'm about to, you know, blend it up and strain it before I add all the different fixings, okay? So, how exactly you boil the sea moss? I boiled it with some... I used some bay leaves that my mom sent and some cinnamon stick and I am now going to show you what it looks like. It boiled, it kind of cooled down a little bit and now I'm going to pour some of it in the blender and blend that up. So how long you put it to boil for? I would say just about 10 minutes, not even all that. So I'm gonna take this out, I'm gonna pour um, a bit of it in here. Hopefully it, it doesn't all, you know what? I'm just gonna do this over the sink. <laughs> it's better that way so I don't spill it all over the place. I'm just gonna pour some of it in here. Yes. So, I am going to blend this and then I am going to strain that out. I'm going to blend, it's about six cups thereabout, so I'm just going to press blend. changed color from the you know this color here which is kind of brown because I boil it and uh, it was dry and all of that and now you get that kind of milky color right now and I am just going to lick I'm gonna press the one that says liquefy and then I'm gonna strain that out and boil a little bit more because the this pack of sea moss could make about two jars of these so i am just gonna liquefy this a bit again strain it out and then boil a little bit more all right that's good now i am gonna strain this out so let me put this back on the pot here on the stove top i have my my strainer and my my wooden spoon so I'm going to take this out I'm just going to strain it in here oh y'all don't understand how this looks and then I'm going to blend a little bit more for you to see what it looks like before I pour it in a jar well hold on I'm gonna pour it in a jar now so I'll have more space. Ooh! Okay. Yes, this is 
this could be tricky. I am going to get some paper towel and make sure I wipe this up. I don't have a funnel or anything, so I'm just using what I have on this. Good. We're good to go. So I'm going to just pour some more of these in here. I'm going to do it over the sink. Let me put this away. Just a little bit more so then I can show you what next I do. boiling how do you know when it's time to take it out yeah well you would see that the the sea moss has broken up you know it's it's almost dissolved and then you know it's time to take it out so I'm gonna press blend again on these I'm gonna now press liquefy strain this baby and then woo, okay nice and strained I'm gonna blend the others later on today I'm gonna pour this in here hopefully I don't lose everything no great job I did it I taught you well and, and now let me get some paper towel just to wipe down this counter a little bit Now is the fun part for me. So now that you have your jar, it's all blended. Um, I am going to add some of these fixings here. I have some cinnamon, some nutmeg. I have a little bit of vanilla essence. And you can choose what type of milk you want. Traditionally, we would use the sweetened condensed milk and or evaporated milk. I am going to use both methods in here to show you and um, get that taken care of. But in the meantime, if you have questions, you can certainly ask me as I open these um, milk. <laughs> so, how I was gonna ask if no milk was being added. Oh yeah, yeah. Just, oh, yeah. You're just transitioning into that. Yes, Howard, definitely I'm gonna add the milk, man. Yeah, back in Antigua, we only drink carnage and evaporated milk, you know? <laughs> yes, there's a joke, an inside joke about this. We can't tell you here, but my husband loves carnation milk. So, okay, I'm pouring a little bit. I'm pouring half of this in here. Um, and then I am going to pour the rest of these sweetened milk. Well, let me see. Maybe half sweetened it. So that's it. not regular milk. That's sweetened milk. Yes, that's sweetened milk. And I am going to add some, ooh, it's nice and frothy, y'all, some vanilla extract in here. Oh, I'm telling you. And I have a little of the, the cinnamon, uh, about a, a half a teaspoon of each. And I'm going to put it in here. Oh, my goodness. Y'all don't understand. And yes, we're gonna sweeten that baby. So let me move this out of the way so you can see a little bit of what is taking place. I am just sweetening up the sea moss here. I have to give it a taste or maybe give the, the man of the house a taste and see if he approves already. I mean, of course, this has to be cool, but for now, I am going to taste it. I just seasoned my sea <laughs> Oh my goodness. Look at this. Let me taste. And then I'll wash up. Oh, so I think it needs some sweetened milk again. I'm going to add some more sweetened milk to that. Give me a, a quick hand wash since I taste it in there, but I'm gonna use the rest of this condensed milk. Now, if you do not have condensed milk and you have um, 
white sugar you can use that as well that's that's perfectly fine i've used white milk before i've mixed it with evaporated i've i mean i've done it all <laughs> Yes. So this is, you know. So Howard was telling me that as for the fixings, we in Antigua just add the Stinger Vine, you know, aka Haas Tonic for extra boost. What? Do you have such to be added um, for the plus ultra <laughs> No, 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 no. Listen, Gre we Grenadians have the real sea moss, so we don't need to add no extra, extra <laughs> than than a little nutmeg and a little cinnamon and we call that George. No, Rasta don't call that George, only yes. Jane. Yes. Alright, listen, this is a simple, simple, simple recipe. I'm tasting it again. Yes. That's what I'm talking about, my people. Oh my goodness. So, so you have this jar of goodness. I'm gonna put the set this aside here. And let's just use a, a glass so I can serve my hubby. It is such a beautiful I, drink. It's milky. If you're not into milky drink, then I don't know <laughs> what you would use for this. May, may I approach the bench? Yes, you can. Yes, you All can right. approach the bench. I, I can't just what, approach the bench. Right? What, what so, are you looking for to approach the bench? Don't, don't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Before I need to I get some ice. I, I'm gonna get a glass and some ice so that he can have some. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Thing have to sort out there, you know. As I'm about to approach the bench here, I have to get my seasoning. Oh my goodness! You, the people need to see sea moss. I am going to seen. pour you a glass just, and you can do what you I'm want just my after here. Yes, I will taste it. After don't worry, man. Huh, the hubbins. Ha! Okay. So I'm gonna take some ice. Okay, oh, good. So we have a question there that's coming up as to if you can make a non-dairy version for people like them, Esther. <laughs> well, I have not tried it without dairy before. But maybe, um, I know they have a lot of different versions, you know, for people who are vegans and so forth now, they have their special type of milk or, or milk substitute that you possibly can look up, like almond um, milk because it's, it is the extract from the, the nuts almonds. So maybe you can try something like that um, to substitute for, some, for the type of milk we use here. Okay. So now I'm pouring it in my hubby's special glass. I gave him that for his anniversary, I think, last year. This so now we have huh? this, this because but they'll see your special glass. Mm. So I have ice in there. I have the beautiful jar. I'm going to pour some of this in. It's already thickening up. Oh, it is thick, y'all. And I am just going to put just a tad of the nutmeg and the cinnamon right on the top just for garnish if you will yes just a little bit of that you know i'm just gonna rest the oh there we go so you got it all right here y'all there you have it done done and done this is such a quick um video if you do things in advance and you have your whole CMOS drink right here. I know a lot of the guys really, really, really love that. <laughs> why, why do you know we, we, they say it's good for the back. I, I don't know. I just I just grew up drinking it. It's fine. I guess it's not good for my back. But it's <laughs> oh my goodness. You it's not. Oh my goodness. Oh, Right, my people. So here we have it. Sea moss is done. I, I am going it's, to. It's lovely. It tastes just like how I used to make so it. So it's kind of like ice cream for me. I mean, but that I might be the, the thing, All right, honey, to What's make sea moss ice cream. Mm -hmm. Now this, it's it's mm -hmm. it is delicious. I think so. 
And I mean, obviously my husband minutes. thinks so. Well, I don't it's know. It's seasoning. It's just well, seasoning. Well, we it's are... I don't know what season he's doing. He have all the seasoning in here already, mm -hmm. so... Um, I think that is... It, it, see if the people have any questions. If you have I'm any questions, I would like to, to... To answer these questions and put this away so it can cool down. So... How was just saying? It's a strong back drink. It's a strong. Um, <laughs> um, oh my goodness! Um, All right. Uh, I anybody don't think else? Have any questions? Today. No questions today. It's. I know it is a quick video. I just wanted to do. This is a memorial weekend up here. I. I. I wish all of the veterans and you know people who have um, fought in war and whatnot. Um, you know, our love and hearts and prayers and support and everything goes out to you guys and your families. And I am happy that you all joined me here on a Friday. Make sure and like, subscribe, share uh, here at another episode on Spice Isle Cafe. We did CMOS today and uh, we look forward to what we're going to do for next week.